And he's attacking the same goal from which he scored. It'd be great if he could uh, register again. He took his goal the other day very well, as we he did, did yeah. here at Oakwell. And Windass plays it back towards uh, Barry Bannon. It goes forward, but that's uh, headed away. Barnsley clearing their lines. Anderson got his head to it and he clears it again, this time with his boot up towards the front, towards uh, Dyke, but he doesn't manage to uh, control it. Again, it'll be uh, turned forward. And uh, Dyke trying to get it under control. There's a pillar in our way, but uh, Dyke has gone past into the box and he tries to cross it. And he puts some real force into that cross. It flashed across our area. It's come back for Barnsley, right hand side. It'll be turned back into the box and it's headed out there by Julian Burner. But a good start there from Barnsley. Dyke's been a real revelation for them, Daryl Dyke. Luke travelling with the party. And uh, we did see him out there warming up as well. It's like a corner to Barnsley. Now a corner. So uh, Barnsley having a little bit of pressure here at the start of the match. Here he comes now. And the delivery isn't bad. Wildsmith has to punch it behind. I think they were trying to obstruct him a little bit. But he has conceded a further corner kick. Well, he got his hand onto that. Looks as though he was stood on just afterwards. Uh, the right decision, I don't think. Uh, it's a decent corner. So they'll uh, have another whirl at it. Let's see whether Wednesday can clear the lines a little bit more convincingly this time. It goes into the area, and it looks like a few missed headers in there. And at the back post, someone scooped it up over the top of the crossbar, and that was a chance, and the first chance. And it comes the way of Barnsley. And, uh, well, we're a bit let, let off there, aren't we, John? Uh, looked like Sol Bauer was going to be putting that home. Well, I think it's just bounced a little bit too high for him. He's tried to keep it down, and uh, anything on target's in the back of the net. He's only two or three yards out, but... The ball is uh, brought down. It comes towards Mauer, who works it over towards the right-hand side. That was a bowler who was... Uh, yeah, he watched it well, didn't he, to be fair he to got him. it down the line in towards Dyke, who's going to try and cut it across, and it hits Joe Wildsmith. Well, I don't know if he tries to grab that. There was too much force on it to take it cleanly and it ricocheted off him went out and it could have gone anywhere as it is it's out for a throw it is it on this side yeah it's a Wednesday throw but uh, that was an excellent uh, he's probably tried to put it into an area and uh, it's ended up uh, bouncing off for of Joe and as you said he was lucky that uh, they weren't a Barnsley player this is going to go towards the halfway line Wednesday trying to win the ball back and it's going to go well, through, through this on. This is an opportunity. It's Windass, controls it, cuts back. He's going to try and pass it away this time for Adam Reach. Lifts Set it up in the up. box. Can Wednesday head it? Well, it's Liam Palmer arriving and the whistle has sounded. Well, Palmer, I don't think, really headed it with any true conviction. He was up against Styles. You kind of want it to go to Patterson, I suppose, and he never really looked like he was going to get there. Palmer was arriving late, but the whistle has sounded. Nothing comes of that attack. Well, there was an opportunity there. That stood up at the far post, I think. Uh, in towards Patterson. But he didn't win it, but Pelopes is there to pick up the piece for Wednesday. Julian Burner just slightly stood on the ball, but he's able to play it away. Ooh, Looking can for he get the run there? here from Rhodes. He's he got, got ahead of the goalkeeper. Jordan Rhodes goes oh. for goal, and he ends up missing the target. He had to react quickly. The defence was closing down on him, but he got there ahead of Brad Collins, but he just couldn't hit the target. Bouncing ball. Nine times out of ten, you back him to score there. Big time, yeah. I mean, it's a great opportunity. He's done well. He's got there. He's beat the goalkeeper. And he's gone. It's a difficult one because he's sort of got it on the half volley with the outside of his foot. And he's, I don't, it's difficult to see how far away he was on that uh, with that shot. Didn't look far away. I thought it's just I, from where I am. I thought it was, a, it was a, in, all, in all the way. So at one stage, it looked like he was going to be missing from this game. Having got uh, a red card, and it's for our uh, point of view, I think it's a bit of a blow that it got overturned because he is a good footballer. And you can see he's on the set pieces, on the corners, and the free kicks. He's preparing to take another one here. He was always very highly regarded during his time at Leeds United. I think he lost his way a bit, but definitely seems to recapture his best now at Barnes's. It goes in towards the area. It's going to be a corner. And it is going to be a corner, you're right. So another chance to put some pressure on for Barnsley. See what they can produce here with Mowat again preparing to uh, sling this over left footed. It goes into the box again, it's crowded around in the area and dropped by uh, the goalkeeper. It's not going to count. Well, Wildsmith dropped the ball. I don't know whether there was a push on him. But I've said he's got blocked off a few times every time those corners go in. Winning a header, 
Pelopesi will get it again as Rhodes ducked out the way for him. Well and then done. it's played away to the left-hand side for Adam Reach. Reach giving it on. That's Wednesday good play. move it back towards Reach there. Windass was the one linking up with him. And it's going to be a throw. Reach needs to see some options to throw this. Bannon's coming towards him. He's just going to go 50 50, I think, in towards no, no Windass. There it is. And he does flick it well, actually. And Bannon. Has the chance to cross it. Great How ball. Is it across the oh, and it Rhodes. goes. The goalkeeper won't keep that one out. It's a bullet header. And Rhodes strikes again. But what a cross from Barry Ballon. Perfect cross, really, for a centre forward. And it's Rhodes who takes advantage of it. Barnsley fall behind here at Oakwell. Barnsley nil. Wednesday one. Terrific goal, that. A great crossing from Bannon. And Jordan Rhodes has just met that absolutely superbly. Headed that back into the far corner. No chance for the goalkeeper. And Wednesday lead 1 0 at Oakwell. Who would have thought that? But it's about, we've said it before, it's about maintaining that advantage and not giving it away. But Jordan Rhodes didn't have to take that well and set up a goal midweek, scored against Norwich and he scored again here. Well, Jordan Rhodes got a couple of superb goals. I mean, the one at Bournemouth, if yeah, you remember that, like one. that one. Yeah, it was. Done well. Comes back again, though, towards uh, Palmer for Barnsley in towards uh, Styles, and it's gone down the line Mowat plays it on and that's a little back heel attempted there by Woodrow come and on they might get a chance here with Styles to try and cut it back it's blocked by Tom Lees and Wednesday will clear it there with Liam Palmer he didn't really get the distance on it and he gave it back for Barnsley it's going to be headed away I think uh, Joe Burn. Wildsmith's got a problem. He's limping. He's gone down to the ground. That's why when uh, Liam well, made the clearance, he was concerned about his goalkeeper. Something happened to uh, Wildsmith there. I, I didn't see. I mean, I keep saying they've got this massive pole in front. But I didn't see what happened to Joe. Referee was uh, really insistent on the physio coming on as quickly as possible. It, like you said, doesn't look good. So I was wondering why Liam Palmer was looking over his shoulder. I think that it's one of the Barnsley players goes into him. It might be Dyke, actually, who just catches him at the front post. So uh, you, you see it there where Styles has gone in behind. They try to cross it, and I think someone's oh, yeah, just yeah. collided in with him. And prepares to kick this one away. Does that now. That's trying to find kick. Adam Reach, and he might pick him out here. Well, the defender had to get something on it, and he did just about Britain. One by Pelopessi. He's made some good interceptions today. Another header won by Anderson. And then it's just hooked up in the air by Styles. Wednesday won't get this ball, but Styles miscontrolled Chance. it. Palmer touches Still on. A chance Still for Windass. He runs through. He's going to slot it across and Rose yes! is there. Yes, get in there. That's the second for Wednesday and so unselfish there for Windass. He could have taken it himself. No one would have blamed him, but he decided to pick out Rhodes on the floor and he side foots it home. And Wednesday have a second goal and lead Barnsley now by two goals to nil. Well, that high line that Barnsley play again, Josh Windass taking advantage of that. His pace got him onto it. He's got away from a, a simple side foot across the uh, six-yard box. And no mistake from Jordan Rhodes. I was going to ask you, actually, in the first half, whether you feel that the way we're playing today is, is partly being driven by those tactics that Barnsley are using. Well, uh, if they are, if obviously they will have watched Barnsley and see that. And uh, we said at half-time that Josh Windus can, you know, he can take advantage of that high line because he's, he's uh, a pacey forward. Uh, and on that occasion, he showed exactly, exactly what to do. That's two then for Jordan Rhodes. With Rhodes, who just uh, flicks it on, it drops down to the halfway line. And again, they try Great and fire ball. it forward out towards the right-hand side. Britain chance to cut it back, but he plays it a bit too close to the goalkeeper. And it's fired in towards Wildsmith, who gathers it up. Needed to pull it back. Yeah, it's good positioning. Joe made it look simple. Terrific uh, diagonal ball into the path of Britain it goes long and there was a lovely uh, little Rhodes touch. who just guided it on for Windass and ah. the angles against him he's trying to well, catch out Collins who again not for the first time has come quite a way off his line 
but the angle was really not really uh, supporting Windass there. He would have taken a brilliant finish to score. Paul Williams just passing on a bit of information. It's going to be a long throw from Britain. It's going to be sent in towards our area. In it goes towards Hamey. He wins a header. It's going to come back for Morris, who hits it. And they've got one back at Barnsley. Well, I think they got deflected it, as well. It seemed to, didn't it? Joe seemed to be rooted to the spot. And Barnsley thrown a lifeline. It's the substitute, Carlton Morris, who struck, oh, yes. ran about the penalty spot. And again, Wednesday concede. And now they could be in for an interesting finish, to say the least. It's now Barnsley 1, Wednesday 2. 12 minutes to go. I couldn't see. Let's have a look. I don't know, this thing's uh, moving around. I'm not sure if it was Tom Lees or... Looked as though it just uh, deflected off one of the Wednesday defenders. Possibly so, yeah, it's taking it away from him. So after Lee Bowie's great start, uh, maybe normal service resume there. Because Wednesday have got Watford to come in the next game. Oh, go on, get it away. It's with Green. He's done well. He's done Green really brings well. it under control. He's trying to run can hard. It? He's got support from Pelopesi. Needs to release it, and he has now. Joey's got it on this right hand side. Back for Green using his pace. He's in the area. Take it first time. Big deflection. Well it's a great goes run. behind. It's going to be a corner. Yeah, it's a great run from Green. Used his running power there. Yeah, he did. Excellent. Carried it really well. Bought a 60, 70 yards. Got us a corner. Can run the clock down a little bit more. There's just about. Just less than five minutes to go, normal time. It goes forward now. Yeah, let's win, have a win. In the yeah. air. Well Again, done. Rhodes wins the flick on, but it drops down there towards uh, Styles. That's plays time it back now, for his keeper. That's time. It's with Collins. Collins plays it short, bounces on, and bobbles really into the path of Britain. Blocked off by Barry Bannon. There you go. And the full time whistle blows, and you can see what it means to the players. Look at Barry Bannon there. Delighted at the outcome, and he gives a personal thanks there to Jordan Rhodes because he got both the goals for Wednesday that gave them a 2 0 advantage. Things did get interesting when the substitute Carlton Morris pulled one back for Barnsley, but uh, Darren Moore has his first win as Wednesday manager, and I think over the piece, Wednesday deserved that. Yeah, he's played uh, good tactics, you know, uh, played to our strengths, and uh, did what we had to do. If we'd played like that, with uh, that uh, sort of confidence and uh, work rate,